So for today, we're going to be looking at the Festival of the Lost Eververse. <clears throat> so for today, we're going to be looking at Eververse more specifically. We're going to be looking at the Festival of the Lost stuff. Don't worry, Titans and Warlocks, we will be looking at your stuff as well. Hunters are going to go first just because that's how it usually goes. But if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe, it really does help because a huge portion of people are actually going to subscribe. So if you can do me a favor, like, comment, sub, hit the bell notification because it also does help. Other than that, let's get into it. So to start off, we're going to be looking at the Bright Dust offerings first. So Skelligal. Shadow Strike, the Gorge Summoner, Jacko Shell, and for the stuff at the bottom, we have <clears throat> Worm Perilous, Grotesque Lapis. It does change color. Wow. Was not expecting that. The wretched bow? Bow? Whatever. Pretty decent. Uh the eternal or eternal shell. Uh jump scare. Knock knock. And for the stuff at the bottom, transmit effects. Uh, luminous cocoon. We have up in smoke. Uh, arachnophile. And then for the shaders, clinging cobweb. Vibrant medusa. Mel, 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 is whatever, and then dark flore floor science fluorescence. This one looks cool. So that's pretty much it for the bright dust offerings. For everything else, we're going to be looking at we've already seen what the fuck we'll see the dec decolate decolated dread, and then conductive hubris. Or the actual armor for the hunters it's right here. I'm gonna be honest. In game, I'm not a big fan of this armor. I mean, obviously, we're still gonna get this armor so we can review it. Um, I'm just gonna tell you guys honestly. I think the helmet's gonna be the one thing I'm actually really excited to use for a scorn look. If the purple glow doesn't change color, that's gonna be really annoying. Hopefully, it changes colors. We'll see. I mean, I'm gonna get this after I make this video. Um, you can get you can get it for brightness as well if you're. You are wondering uh cade six mask <clears throat> i saw someone make a really cool cade six inspired set which is really cool witness mask how disrespectful this is we just killed this dude and we just made him i mean to be fair it's not the first boss we've done that too stone cold smash colony crush trick row trio have a balloon and we've already seen that one, seen that one, boo. Sorry if my frames drop, I'm currently playing another game and trying to like not waste time. Interstellar Shell, I'll show you what game I'm playing at the end, I guess. So you guys can make fun of me. Um, seen that one, seen that one, seen that one, seen that one. This one we have not seen. It looks cool though. Very, very bitchin' actually. Mm. Um, we're not looking at... I draw the line at gross projections. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to look at all the Hunter stuff at the end of the Eververse stuff. And then we'll go back to this so that way it could seem like at the... It's for the timestamps, honestly. Um, yeah, yeah. So, Bashing Bumpkins. Pocket Punch. Ding. One inch punch. And vampiric pose. Pumpkin carving. 
this is mostly for you guys i fucking hate emotes i i legitimately fucking loathe them so i do this for you guys not for myself because i again i don't like emotes i don't really care for them buster ray there's only like it's very rare for me to actually like one this one being one of them i think it's pretty cool Gourd Summoner, which you've already seen. Strange Brew. Lunar Roar. <clears throat> uh, Ghostly Durance. Tombstone. I think this one's dope. Like, especially for PvP, it's disrespectful. Uh, heroic uh, Guitarist. Uh, prankster dance and then for the shells we have confection shell heart powered shell spinneret shell paper craft or an eye shell oh it's a the spider uh, hazy future shell Calavera shell Fettered shell <laughs> I think the color does change color the color does change the shaders change the glow of it is what I meant this one looks fire um, Hexing shell Sugary staple which is That's funny Legitimately funny. Oh, I am cool. candy corn. I fucking hate candy corn. Digi and Steed. I still think this one looks fucking cool, bro. I don't, don't want to buy that. The Mourner, which definitely looks cool. Majestic Whiny or Winnie. Mad Machine Nuri. <laughs> scare, scare. <laughs> I still find it funny. <laughs> Uh, halted Oblivion. You've already seen that. Fairy tale sh uh, flight. Wow. Extraterrestrial vehicle. This one does look cool. Mance Macabre. Look, Macabre. Unit oh, that's pretty cool. Sorry, um, retrograde tour. Basically, the mystery machine, bro. Lipid. I'm not gonna try to say it. It's a fucking. Looks like a butterfly. Um, more emotes. Jesus Christ, bro. Skeletal dance. Zombie shuffle. No escape. Hold me. <sighs> okay. Necromance dance. Sorry, I'm just, again, so many fucking emotes for like way too much money, in my opinion. Five bucks for an emote? You can eat my whole ass. To be fair, though, I am not an emote person, so like. For me, it, for for me to like actually want to get an emo, it would have to be like under two bucks, dog. Cause that's, it's an emo, whatever, dog. Oh, so I'm just gonna stop saying the name. You, you guys can fucking read it. I'm so done doing this, dude. What I had of this one? they gave everyone the same not same skins but like the different skins that the of all the other classes so like I mean, hunters ended up getting a werewolf set 
the warlocks ended up getting a vampire skin and then the titans ended up getting a frankenstein skin i wish the hunters and titans and warlocks got each got one of those so like hunters instead of a vampire skin or instead of a war werewolf skin they got a vampire set and vice versa like for every class i think that would have been cool because uh yeah i want a vampire set for the hunters <laughs> um disciple mask good boy mask yeah finch mask massive ass skin dog the star horse mask Sh shaded titan mask they need to put the hunter and titan warlock helmets that would be cool penguin mask associates mask spider mask uh omni ghoul mask an old an old enemy jack-o-lantern mask uh glitter ball mask colonel mask promethean prelude or what is it called grand overture we have a uh, parasite. We've already seen this, but might as well see it again. And last but not least, fighting lion with the pride glass. That is pretty much it for all of the things that I really give a shit about. I mean, we're going to be looking at the hunter stuff, obviously. So first and foremost, let me talk about a little bit more about this one. So I think the helmet's going to be really, really cool. Um, the only pieces that I'm going to see have me having trouble personally is going to be the arms. And that's really it. Um, cloak is going to be really rough to st actually do like a something with it like because it's very distinct to being a like wizard hat that being said it's not going to be super duper hard um the, the pieces where i'm really excited for is going to be the helmet and the the boots chest piece as well to a certain extent but mostly the helmet and the and the boots i think these two are going to be super super dope um for the other sets it's going to be let me see so it's going to be the megalomorph stuff for the hunters um definitely really cool i love this one that being said um you for me i really only bought it well aside from making a video on it um the chest piece and the boots i think are the best pieces um not saying the helmet is bad or by any means i like the helmet it's just the chest piece and the boots i use a lot more arms i think are pretty terrible i think the the class item is cool i just don't use them as much as i would like this one is pretty much doo-doo butter in my opinion. Um, it's just so many things that are prob problematic with it. You guys will see when we look at the Titans and Hunter or Warlocks. Um, it's just not even with armor pieces and it's way too much like leather for it to be like a mecha set, which is why I get really annoyed by it because it's just like, why, why though? Um, really cool set, which is going to be the Robo Raptor Hunter set. So yeah. You guys can see the top jaw or the bottom jaw and then the top of that is really cool. That's the helmet cloak. Um, chest piece I think is cool. Boots are, I think are super cool, especially with the talons. And then I think the arms are the only piece where I'm like, whatever is on if I'm being quite honest. Um, we have the Canis Luna Hunter set, which I think is really cool. Um, that being said, the helmet takes off colors. The cloak takes off colors like here and then main color here if i remember correctly um chest piece i think is pretty terrible and boots are, i think are pretty whatevers i think the, the arms i actually use quite a bit on my viking sets and then we still have a few no we don't what did they take away the really the old one like the bad one i think they did there's supposed to be another one where it's like uh actually you see it in in one of the emotes i think not me showcasing the emo but like the here it is yeah this armor is not here anymore interesting the armor is really trash anyway this is just blue armor with a skeleton face on it never really bought it myself just because why would i but that is pretty much it for the hunters let me know what you guys think as for the titans let's actually see real quick so ooh, okay okay so I think the helmet is pretty cool. It's just unfortunately you're going to lean into that war or not war that a uh, warlock vibe. Arms super cool actually. I can you can combine this for a cowboy set and it's actually going to look pretty decent. Uh, not cowboy, I'm sorry. I mean um what was it? Uh, a pirate. Pirate set. That's what I meant. 
definitely going to be able to combine this with a pirate set and it's actually going to look pretty decent chess piece is pretty decent as well um yeah it's pretty cool actually boots i think are really cool same thing as the arms you definitely can put this in a pirate set and it's going to look pretty decent the mark i think is beautiful i think overall titans probably won this time just because their set looks really clean compared to the like evil warlock that we get for everyone else it's just, i personally don't fuck with it per like i don't know it's really rough i would have to go back to my older video to see like what the verdict was but yeah i wish we got this for all the classes just because it looks way more clean but of course hunters gotta be edgy which is why those won i'm surprised the warlocks got the edgy set um as for the armor sets we have the crawling chaos set for the titans and honestly you're gonna be buying this for one piece which is gonna be the boots i think the boots are the best piece from this like bar not bar none dog like legitimately super dope especially if you want to go for like a hive night these are the boots you're gonna want to go get everything else i think is pretty terrible um this one super cool i think the helmet is like the best piece from the whole set i think the boots are super dope just be aware that it does shader really weird but overall i do think this is a good set um this set the boots i think are my favorite piece i don't even I, don't, I shouldn't say i think it is my favorite piece just because i combine it with so many cool sets arms are decent chest piece is decent i think the helmet's okay and the market thing is the boring the most boring piece from that whole set and then t dude the chem flesh one i think is really cool unfortunately it's just the fact that it it's leaning into that like frankenstein bits and pieces vibe a lot which isn't the worst thing in the world mind you it's just you're gonna you're gonna need to be careful to combining this i also i just realized um i don't want to say it's a reshape or it's a reskin because it really technically isn't but it is a there is pieces of the um the mars armor from or like the planetary mars armor because you can see it from right here and the chest piece as well but that's not the biggest deal in the world considering it is it does change it quite a bit so that is pretty yeah that's pretty much it that is the armor for the titans let me know what you guys think and last but not least we have the warlocks which <sighs> i really would have liked this mask if they didn't have the hat honestly because then i could have gone in i mean you can still go for a scorn look it's just gonna look like a witch scorn which however you well, i don't know if you like that i guess Ooh, ooh, the arms the arms are good the arms are really good okay i fuck with the arms um i think the chest piece is super dope as well um actually really really good the bond let's check out the bond real quick meh very meh meh i think the boots are pretty cool as well so overall i actually think a lot of this is really really cool that being said i still think i prefer the like good uh wizard look overall just because it looks i think way cleaner I'm not saying this is bad by any means it's just i, I don't know I, I definitely have to like get the armor and see how i feel about it but for the other stuff we have the oh that's right the carapace warlock which you guys didn't get the spider set you guys got the beetle set which is kind of unfortunate because i did like the witch or the spider set for you guys <sighs> yeah we have uh the exoskeleton set for yeah i think this set looks so cool dude like i have combined this with like some cool pieces chest piece boots helmet arms I've, like i've used a lot of these except the bond i think the bond's the worst part um this one's pretty rough as well i think that helmet's pretty trash honestly i'm surprised they gave warlocks a triceratops when they could have just given them a pterodactyl i think that would have been way better because then you could have had a like you could have like a like an like a wing type of thing like not a wing but like kind of like a you know how like frogs have webbed um fingers kind of like that like webbed uh between like right here and down here that would have been way cool to like make it seem like you're a pterodactyl um and then give them a pterodactyl helmet i don't know triceratops just doesn't fit warlocks i think titans fit more much more of a triceratops but i understand they wanted to give tri a t-rex and wreck and t-rex um raptors and triceratops because those are, those are the most popular dinosaurs but i still think a triceratops would or a, a, rather a pterodactyl would have been way better for warlocks 
And then the vampire set, which I definitely would recommend because it's really, really good. Helmet, super dope. Boots are super cool. Chest piece is amazing. Bond is really cool. I think that honestly, my the arms are like probably my favorite just because they do have the, uh, the pointy bits at the top or at the fingertips. So overall, that is pretty much it. Let me know what you guys are going to be picking up. Again, like I said, be expecting an armor set video for... Uh, for this armor, we're going to be doing the review, shaders, and then the class specific videos. Obviously, that's what we usually do. And then after that, I'm probably going to push these as fast as I can because I want to po post some other stuff. Um, also, be aware that because we don't have the Assassin's Creed stuff, I'm not going to be posting any of the Assassin's Creed videos. That being said, it's probably going to be really helpful for me because I'm going to be posting a lot of that. Um, I'm going to be post like I'm going to be making those right now or between this week. So that way I can have those videos up ready for you guys. Um, I'm not going to show you the game that I'm playing right now, but just it's a weeby game. Just expect that. Um, it's called a uh, Nick, Nikki or Nikkei, 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 whatever. Uh, it's like it's a mobile game that I've been playing. And funnily enough, you can download it on your computer. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, again, I'm currently working on a few things mostly destiny 2 related but i am working on some other non-destiny 2 fashion as well my second channel is popping off because i am actually posting all my gameplay there as well so if you guys want to see um some tekken 8 campaign i'm posting all of that and i'm also posting the space marine 2 stuff tomorrow will be episode i think six or seven i don't remember so i'm also doing my second channel a lot so let me know what you guys think i appreciate y'all be safe i'll see you guys later